All right, so I wanted to make a little recording here, something I'll probably do a little bit from time to time, just as uh, an update, uh, as well as keeping myself accountable. Um, for those of you who maybe have seen some posts or watched some stories, things like that, uh, or if this is on YouTube, then shorts, um, I started competing in the Scottish Highland Games back in September of 2022. And with that revitalized my desire to work out because now I had to train to compete. And so I hadn't really been working out for a handful of years and just kind of feeling not, it was feeling non-desirable to go work out. So I didn't ever. And then now that I have competitions to get me moving, I've been working out pretty consistently since then, since September. It is now Friday, July 21st. I don't remember the date, I think it's the 21st. And um, I started this last Monday on a uh, full carnivore diet. A full, if you wanna call it elimination, call it carnivore, it doesn't matter to me. Um, I don't really care what it's called. Um, basically what I'm doing is I'm gonna just eat meat and I'm gonna drink water. Uh, I'm currently drinking coffee in the mornings with heavy cream. Um, and that's pretty much gonna be it. Uh, I plan on eliminating coffee at some point when I feel like it. Um, but uh, what led to really deciding to go ahead and, and going full meat-based is uh, within training over the last nine plus months, um, I've noticed my knees still swell uh, depending on you know the training session or the competition I've done. Um, my left knee has been giving me lots of problems over the, over the years, let alone recently. Uh, I get a lot of fluid buildup, uh, lots of pain in both knees. Uh, every morning I wake up and get out of bed, I feel like I'm walking on a bed of knives. Uh, it's very painful and um, uh, it just takes a while for my body to get moving in the morning. And so I've done carnivore in the past, great results, weight loss. I do have plenty of excess fat that I want to get rid of. Uh, and so. I, uh, I just decided that it's time to do that again, and this time uh, just get my body to a point where I'm, I'm happy and I'm comfortable and I'm no longer feeling that pain. So um, could this be the way to do that? I sure hope so. Uh, I'm gonna give it a go. I have no definitive end result uh, or end time frame. You know, is it a month, is it six months, a year, two years? I don't have any of that just yet. Uh, like I said, I think I said, I started on Monday. Today's Friday. And I just plan on going until I stop hurting. And if I feel good enough, I'll just keep going with that. So um, yeah, all I'm, all I'm eating right now is uh, beef, some sort of beef, steak, tri-tip, um, ground beef, it doesn't matter. Uh, if I do ground beef, generally I'll add a, a couple eggs. Uh, I don't eat breakfast. Uh, I'll have my coffee in the morning um, that has a little bit of heavy cream, maybe a tablespoon of heavy cream or so. And then I won't eat until if I'm hungry lunch. If I'm not hungry, I'll eat a big old dinner. Uh, this week so far, I've eaten about twice a day. And um, yeah, I'm just going to continue on and, and see kind of where that leads me. Uh, so far, I've noticed in just a handful of days, I've been able to get up in the morning. Now, getting out of bed is still painful. It's not as painful as uh, when I first started. So I can contrast this Friday to last Friday. And um, I've noticed subtle change in the uh, pain in my lower body. Not a huge difference yet, but um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep going because the training's not gonna stop. I'm gonna keep working out. I'm gonna keep training for the Highland Games. I want to uh, see where my peak performance can be coming up to 39 years old so in about a month and a week or two uh, Labor Day weekend I'll turn 39 and uh, just yeah just want to see what I can do with my body as I'm getting older if I can change my nutrition to optimize uh, anti-inflammation and uh, hopefully optimize performance so we will see how that goes that is my update for today Friday I think July 21st and uh, I'll post another one of these when I feel like it uh, in the coming days or weeks to kind of, again, update for myself and um, keep myself a little bit more accountable. So I will see you soon.